Hey guys, this is Austin at Hunt Ford Chrysler in Franklin, Kentucky. I've got something really nice to show you today. We've had such a good response on these YouTube videos that we've done. Uh, I wanted to take a little bit of time and show you Ford's new 2015 F-250 Platinum Edition. I have seen a lot of trucks uh, and this is the nicest truck I believe I have ever seen. This is the new all aluminum body. This is a completely new body style. They've taken cues out of the F-150 playbook, stylized it in that fashion. And I'll tell you what, I'm a big guy. I'm six foot six and this F-250 looks big. The bed height is actually four inches higher uh, than the previous year and previous body style. Obviously, aside from the new body, you'll see the new badging down here. It'll actually say what trim level it is along with what size it is. You also see the 6.7 liter power stroke badge. This kind of font is similar to what you would see on the Raptors. The new front end looks really, really nice. This is definitely a gentleman's truck. On these higher end trucks, they've got a new key fob actually that's really neat i'm going to show you here i can get it out of my pocket it's a very big fob actually but uh you've got your lock your unlock your remote start and then you've also got your tailgate drop which i think is really neat i'm going to show you here you can actually hit this button and that tailgate's gonna drop very slowly and carefully this one's got the spray in liner from Ford from the factory you also have the cleats your box link just like on the f-150s you've also got the LED box lighting here where you can actually hit that button and they light up they don't look bright during the day but at night they're extremely bright also here You've got your integrated tailgate step. This slides out. You've got a handle right here. It pops up. And you can get right up on in there. One other thing I wanted to show you guys that's really neat about these new F1 or F250s, excuse me. There's actually a camera that points down towards the bed so you can actually see what you've got in your bed without having to turn around. You can actually drop these pretty much one-handed once you get the hang of it. It's going to slide right back in there. This is all self-contained. It's very neat. You've got the platinum kind of chromed badge on the back there. One other thing you'll notice you have an LED, so when you put your truck in reverse, that light will come on. Also, one other thing, there's no handle anymore on these. There's just kind of a, a little grommet that you just press and it comes down. That's something different that they have not done in the Super Duties. Also, you've got your blind spot detection, which is a new offering on the Super Duties as well. One other thing that's important to me, you don't realize it until you get used to it. This truck actually comes with a two-way communicator. So like the F-150s, if you're not within earshot of your truck and you're not sure if the truck remote started, you can actually hit this button here. Let me see if I can. So you lock it, you remote start it, 
and it will actually blink green to let you know that the truck has started. So like I said, if you're not within earshot of the truck and you're not sure that the truck started, all you have to do is check that button there. Now this truck has intelligent entry and exit, so you can just put your hand right in here and it's gonna open the door or unlock the door. It knows you've got the fob in your pocket. One other thing, you've got your power deployable running boards here. It's really neat. You can see the stylization of the inside. Very similar to the 150 interior. They did so well with the 150 interior, they pretty much incorporated it into the Super Duties. It's got really nice high quality leather all the way through it. This one obviously is the black interior. You've got your armrest that folds down here and you've got your cup holders right there. Also in the back, you've got air, you've got your wall power outlet, heated rear seats, and you've also got a cigarette lighter adapter right there. One new thing that Ford has implemented, you kind of have this cargo storage area right here, which is pretty neat. Um, you can actually flip this lever down and it automatically flips the lever down on the other side and you can fold this in and the whole thing will just collapse down in there. I would close it, but I've got something over there as you can see, so it won't close. You wanna open it, you just flip it up, lock your lever in there, and you're good to go. It's really nice. I'm gonna show you some stuff on the inside here. You got your door seal plate. It's kinda of hard to tell what that actually lights up. Over here you got your window controls actually got power folding windows there along with telescopic mirrors you got your memory seats down here over to the left of the uh, steering wheel here you've got your LED spot lamps on your side view mirrors you got your headlight controls you've got your adjustable foot pedals here and also one other thing I like they've implemented there's actually a button there to drop your tailgate uh, you can do that from the cab now which is nice you've obviously got your power seat here with your lumbar support gonna jump in here show you some other things over here you've got your push button start turn this air down a little so as you can see all new interior new steering wheel also new gauges can see your upfitter switches are actually mounted up top now they used to be mounted down low by your air controls but now they're up and out of the way they actually light up to let you know you're using them same as the last ones you've got your power sliding back glass here so you can push this down it's gonna open your power sliding back glass one other nice feature that they've implemented you can now get the panoramic sunroof on the super duties so this piece of glass here slides all the way back so you get a nice big roof and then also if you want to get the sun out of your face there's a sunshade that will come all the way up and black out the sun I'm going to show you some features here with this new sync connectivity. This is Ford's new Sync 3. Uh, so it's a new user interface. It's a lot snappier. Um, you can toggle through some different stuff here. Your audio, your climate, your phone, navigation, etc. Now over here in your settings, you'll notice the, the, the touch sensitivity is a lot better on these. You can actually kind of swipe like you would on a smartphone, which I really like. pretty slick you've got your normal controls you know your sound you know equalizer clock navigation stuff like that but you've also got Wi-Fi connectivity here to get automatic updates uh, you've got the Android auto preferences that's gonna give you a little bit more functionality with your Android device and then also on these newer higher trim level super duties you've got the multi contour seats so you can actually turn the massagers on believe it or not no lie and it will massage you as you're going down the road down below here you've got some uh, radio controls and then under here you've got your air controls as well you've got your heated and cooled seats 
Up top here, you've got some controls for obviously, this is, here is your trailer brake, I'm sorry, not your trailer brake, your exhaust brake controller. Uh, this is actually gonna help slow the truck down uh, without you having to put the pads to your rotors and heating your rotors up. You've got your traction control, your emergency flashers. Up here, you've got your lane departure uh, switch. So you can actually turn the lane departure on and it's gonna let you know when you are veering in and out of the lane. It'll give you a, a little chirp to let you know, hey, pay attention to the road. You've also got your camera button over here, which is really neat. Uh, you've got some different options. Uh, you can do a 360 degree view there. So if I put this truck in reverse, you can actually see, you can see the truck move in real time, which is very neat. So here's some of the toggle options. Uh, you can actually switch it to the front mode there or you can switch it to the panoramic mode up front. There is a camera under each side mirror that kind of gives you a panoramic view. Now we'll put it in reverse and I can show you a couple of other options here. Uh, you can actually see into your truck bed, okay? So that's gonna allow you easier connectivity to your gooseneck or your fifth wheel for your camper. Then you can also zoom in to get a better look at your gooseneck ball. One other thing I like, you can also click the trailer button and the wide angle mirrors or the wide angle camera under your mirrors are actually gonna let you see the line of sight down either side of your truck, which is very neat and uh, very helpful. So I'll put the truck back into park. One other thing I've noticed about these trucks, the sound systems are amazing. I don't know if they've redone the subwoofers uh, or the speakers, but uh, it sounds really, really good. Uh, down here you've got your four-wheel drive along with your lock and rear end. All you have to do is just turn this dial down. It's going to put you into four high and then you can actually pop this out just like you've always been able to to lock your rear differential. You've got your trailer brake controller down here. Down below you've got some USB ports and things of that nature. Same kind of console uh, as there's always been. There's a couple of cigarette lighter adapters in there. Uh, over here to the steering wheel uh, there's some new features. You've got your adaptive cruise control here, so you can set your adaptive cruise control uh, However far you want to be behind a vehicle and the truck will actually slow itself down intelligently Without you having to actually do anything uh, in regard to touching the brake also up here You can see there's some gauge differences uh, You've got your full LCD screen up here. That's completely customizable One thing I like about the new super duties is in the top right corner there you can can kind of customize which information you want to see. So for instance, uh, you can see your DEF gauge there. That's one thing that they've added. A lot of people had a complaint about Ford's trucks would not show you in real time what the DEF level was. It would just tell you when it's low. Now you can actually see it uh, on the fly. So with the gauges down here, everything's customizable. There's a million different things that you can see and customize. Uh, you know, there's your fuel economy, obviously. Um, you can check your tire pressure on the fly, transmission temperature, uh, you know, you can see your turbo boost. Uh, there's a lot of neat stuff there. There's a lot of trailer towing functionality. Uh, you know, you can check information on your trailer. Uh, you can even see the trailer tire pressure on the fly if your trailer is capable of doing that, uh, which is really neat. You've also got your off-road options there. Uh, then you can go into your other settings. You know, you've got auto high beams, you've got blind spot controllers, cross traffic alert, rear parking. It even has connectors for uh, blind spots on your trailer. Uh, this one has pre-collision warning as well. Uh, so the truck will actually slow itself down whenever you get close to a vehicle coming, a little, coming in a little too fast. So some very cool functionality there. This is Ford's higher end offering out of their model lineup when it comes to these Super Duties. Um, this truck stickers for a good chunk of change. I'm going to take you over here and let you look at the window sticker if I can get it focused. Now a lot of you all might have a little bit of sticker shock. This truck clocks in at $76,405. Now granted that is Ford's highest end offering. There's a lot of bells and whistles on this thing. But remember you get what you pay for. So guys, I wanna thank you for taking your time to take a look at our video. Uh, if you've got any questions, please don't hesitate to call the dealership. My name is Austin. I am with Hunt Ford. 
and our telephone number is 270-586-3281. We really appreciate your time and we hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks.